what I tried to do was break up these mega projects into smaller projects and, and designate a, uh, a manager for each area with a field engineer and a superintendent and try and create a smaller team within the larger team so that they all feel valuable and part of the big picture. No, it's good to have you back out here, but yeah, you know, one of the rules is that when you come on a construction site, you gotta take the tie off. I think I'm gonna do that. Okay, I don't know what, I don't know what rules you have in Whitestone, but here on a construction site, you know, that's the case that makes you look like a lawyer. <laughs> what you need to do is infuse uh, some uh, older, uh, more experienced folks with some younger, fresh energy, along with uh, diverse people where you can get some uh, attitude and some uh, different ways of doing things that we don't normally do. He gives people responsibility to kind of shine, uh, especially for young people like myself. You know, sometimes someone in a supervision position would be hesitant to give a lot of responsibility. And uh, John is quite the opposite. Once he's, once he's comfortable with the person, he will give them a lot of room to grow and to learn. John, come back. Hey Juan, how are we for uh, Baker Scaffold? North River wants to borrow uh, six or eight sets. John's jobs uh, well chronicled success, FDR Drive, one project of the year, Croton's doing very, very, very well. Other projects have always been successful jobs and John's been involved. Yet John doesn't stand out in the crowd. He does if you're involved in the project, but he wants everyone else to get credit, and he steps back and lets them do this. The most important thing in developing a good client relationship is, is keeping your word. When you say you're going to do something, make sure you do it, and, and never go back on a problem. In the sand. Actually, uh, one of the reasons I, uh, I took up golf is here. The project that I'm currently on is, is, uh, is on a golf course. And uh, the, uh, the team here put together a golf, a Skanska Golf League, where we go out once a week uh, after work and play golf. And it's a great way to bond with the guys and, and have a good time uh, while you're at it. I very rarely see him get frustrated on the golf course. And I can't say the same for myself. That's why we carry more than one ball. The most important thing is you have to enjoy what you do. If you come to work and it's a job, maybe this isn't for you. You, gotta, you have to have the passion and, and, and the determination to enjoy what you do every day because we spend way too many hours doing it and you have to have fun in doing something.